man in Memphis, Jesus Christ. Caught on camera, the chilling moments a man is carjacked at gunpoint outside the Royal King store on West Rains on Easter Sunday. He tries to escape, but is shot and killed. Tonight, WRG's Ashley Paul spoke with that family yeah. of the victim. And Ashley, how are they coping tonight? So he's, he, he, he tries to reach for the gun. He tries to escape, but is shot and killed. And the guy shoots. Tonight, WRG's Ash. Right there. Boom. Dead. Damn. What a fucking. Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ashley Paul spoke with that family of the victim. And Ashley, how are they coping tonight? <sighs> Yeah, Stephanie. Well, Easter is supposed to be a day of love, celebration and family, but instead it was one of tragedy and heartbreak for this family. They say the man in that video is 35 year old Quentin, Quentin Donald, who's a father of three. And they say that he was just grabbing a snack at the store when he was gunned down in broad daylight. Quentin, he's always thought of me as superwoman. You know, he, he thought that I could just handle anything that's thrown my way. But this is a challenge Ariel Showers never could have imagined. She was set to marry 35-year-old Quentin Donald next year after nearly two decades together. Now... <laughs> we escaped. <laughs> we time to get to know each other. Jesus Christ. Which means that if they were set to marry, they probably been set to marry for decades. So which means that they probably wasn't getting married. The only reason they, they've been engaged that, for fifteen years. Yeah. The only reason now she now that he's dead, oh, we was about to get married. <laughs> so that's how that works. Challenge Ariel Showers never could have imagined. She was set to marry thirty-five year old Quentin Donald next year after nearly two decades together. Now, instead of planning their wedding, she's planning his funeral. He never made an enemy. He never got in trouble outside of a traffic ticket. Um, and it's, that's why it's so hard to cope with this. She says Donald is the victim. 20 years is a long marriage in the black community, isn't it? I think it's a long marriage for most communities, but yeah, you're right. This guy, this guy, man... Um... Man. It's so hard to cope with this. She says Donald is the victim in this video released by the Memphis Police Department. She says he is the man in the white shirt standing next to one of the suspects outside the Royal King convenience store when a struggle breaks out. You see him run away from the car when a second suspect in red comes at him with oh, a pointed gun. No. Police. We see that. Oh. And a homeboy coming out of the corner. I thought this was the guy that killed them. Oh, shit. And no, where's the marching? Where's the marching? Where's the marching? Where's the protesting? I mean, this guy never had a traffic ticket, right? He got a nice little car. Went to get a snack, right? It wasn't, it wasn't a drug transaction, nothing like that. He was just going to get a snack. And... Dude, to one of the suspects outside the Royal King convenience store when a struggle breaks out. You see him run away from the car when a second suspect in red comes at him with a pointed gun. Man. Police say a third suspect in a white shirt and blue pants Ed. also opened. <laughs> damn. damn. That was an execution. This is broad daylight. This is broad daylight. And this is normal, as we can see, as you guys can see, um, tweet, I mean, God damn, I mean, glad you said they okay. don't plan this stuff, Ox. This is pretty well fucking planned. This is not planned, man. They would carjack, if he would have gave the car up, none of this would have happened, man. This is not a plan. Well, yeah, man. but I'm sure he thought, okay, it's just this joker, maybe somebody else in another car. Hell no, he's got three to deal with. Yeah. Well, this is, this is, this right here, this is this is brutal. This is brutality. They're all shooting this guy down, and the glider in Kansas City. They probably protested about that in Memphis. Open fire, taking the life of not just a fiance but a father of three. That was my best friend, my ride or die, right there. Sixteen-year-old <laughs> Layla is Donald's oldest daughter. Through tears, she tells us she will live the rest of her life 
to make her father proud. I always talked to him about becoming a veterinarian and he, you know, he was supporting of my dream and I would, you know, want to make him proud. The youngest is this little one, only three months old. The family vows to make sure she grows up knowing the amazing person her father was and that he was taken from her far too soon in a senseless act of violence. It needs to stop. It needs to stop. There's no way a, a simple a store run should have turned into a, a crime scene. Now, police say the suspects got away in a tan four-door sedan with heavy damage on the passenger side. Anyone with information is asked to contact crime. Oh, that's why they wanted the new car. We'll see, man. Um, man, uh, golly, man. Um, let, let, let's, let's, let's do Philly, man. Get out of here, man. We'll do, we'll, we'll do well, Philly, thank, man. thank God they got rid of the Scorpio squad, man. Yeah, man, because that way, you know, um, it's safe, man. It's safer because the Soviet squad was the problem, man. Whew. They they might have run up. They might have run up on you at any moment, and 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 you know, and stop the crime in the middle of it, right? It's just, man, that's a brutal city, man. That See, that, that's another brutal. one I still have questions about. What? With the Scorpion Squad, how come there's no video from before? Mm. I, well, yeah, that's, uh, I mean, there's no, where's the official autopsy? It was never even had the official autopsy.